When you click on the join link, you will find this screen. If you already have RStudio account, you can log in, but if you don't have, you can sign up with a new email address. This process will require you to verify the email address as well. Once you have logged in, you will see this screen asking you whether you want to join the space or not. If you cannot see this screen when you log in, copy and paste the join URL on your web browser again. It will bring you to this screen. Now we can click on join space. As a result, you will see that you have access to new space for the course. Click on that space. You will find that you will have the lecture one um, as an assignment already. Click start this assignment to open this project. It may take a few minutes until your project is ready. I'm fast forwarding this part here. Click on lecture1code.imd to open the code. Here we can hide the sidebar to give us more space. And you can click the drop down button here and restart R and run all chunks to run all the codes. Once you have run everything, you can also preview the output of the code by using the visual mode. In the visual mode, you will see that these instructional part of the code are rendered as HTML, clearly distinct from the code itself. Sometimes the output in visual mode may be wonky in your um, web browser. You can click on this double chevron button to collapse it and expand it again. Then it will be appropriate again. From this page, you can go back to the list of the projects by clicking on this hamburger menu. And then click on the workspace. You will see that there are two projects with the same name. The first project is basically the assignment template that I have created. And the second project here is your own private copy of the project. So whatever modification that you do here will be saved in your own copy of the project. Suppose something went wrong with the project for example, you accidentally deleted some of the files. You can delete your instance of this project by clicking this button. Or you can move this copy of the project into your space. Let's try that. So once you move the instance of the project to your workspace, now you can restart this assignment again by pressing start. This button will recreate the project from the template that I have prepared for you. Now for the projects that you have moved to your space, you can find it here. Because of this project is in your workspace, only you can see and can access this project. 